hi guys in case you are new here welcome to my youtube channel and remember to subscribe to my channel for the returning subscribers thanks for the for clicking back to my channel so today guys i want us to talk about something security tips things you should not post you should never post on social media so you know in life there are those enemies which are real enemies which they can do anything to kill you if it's possible they can look for ways to kill you if they find ways to kill you they can kill you completely and they are those enemies who are just enemies who envy you they feel like they want their your lifestyle they feel like they want a house like the one you have they need your clothes and those enemies who are not uh, serious they are they also they only envy you so guys uh, there are those things which you should not post on uh, online because they can risk your life one thing is the your physical address the physical address means the place you live. Physical address means where you can be found. Whereas when you tell somebody I live in Eldoret, somebody can come there and find you. That's the physical address. So guys, uh, don't post where you live because you'll be making things easy for bad guys out there. Criminals can trace you easily if you post your a physical address because if they want to find you and they know your physical address they can easily find you or use someone who can find you easily and they can eliminate you another thing is current location maybe you live in a in a certain town and then you are going to another town so don't uh, don't be posting that i am here i am here i am here and i'm doing this because um those people can track you they can follow you and they can um eliminate you because they have a pad uh, they have a pad because they might be having a bad intention about you another thing is never post images and videos of your children uh, never post videos images names schools of their of your children because it's really very risky if you have an enemy who is a real enemy and he wants to kidnap your child he wants to do something about your child so when you keep on posting the pictures the names and the place this your children the school uniforms or the schools they they are it can be easy for the enemy to track the child and get the child and do whatever he or she wants to do um number four is uh, never post negative opinions about your job your boss uh, or your employer because in most cases many people have lost their jobs for posting negative things about their working places if your boss fi uh, finds to know that you are posting negatively on your job you can easily lose your job another thing is that um, when you go to sit for a job also maybe you are seeking for a cleaner pasture maybe you are in another job and then you are seeking for a cleaner pasture those people the interviewers or the what do you call the interviewers can also tell you give us your Facebook um, and your Instagram uh, account and when you give them they will go through and, and uh, when they see that you have been posting negatively in your former employer they will uh, never employ you it will be difficult for you another thing is um, also never post your exact working place because it makes it easy for an enemy who wants to trace you for bad reasons if you post the exact place that you are working it will be very easy for those people who may be the, for those enemies maybe who wants to track you and kill you or do anything else to you it will be very easy for them because they know the exact place that you work and they can do anything they want to do to you and then never post the details of where you are traveling to maybe let's say you want to travel from one town to another so many people like posting that tomorrow i'll be going to this place i'll be staying for this long i'll be doing this i'll be sleeping in this hotel so if you post those details for someone who wants to trace you he or she can easily trace you because they exact uh, they already know your plans they already know that you will be leaving tomorrow at five o'clock at this time and they will simply track you and follow you and do whatever they want to do and then uh, don't uh, don't post your pictures tagging your current locations it's very terrible you are putting yourself at a risk these things of tagging tagging i'm in this place i'm in this place it's very risky because it can also leave people want to get you to get you easily and then another thing is uh don't uh, don't post the hotels that you frequent most of the time because it can be easy for someone to track you so if there is some hotels which you use in town which you frequent each and every time don't 
keep posting them because for someone who wants to track you and find you can easily find you because they know that you are in this hotel at lunch time maybe in the evening maybe dinner time so it will be very very easy for them to really track you another thing is don't post your a frequent shopping shopping malls maybe you like shopping in a certain shopping mall in a certain supermarket in a certain quick shop or anywhere so don't be posting those places where you frequent shop you frequently shop because also it can make easy for an enemy who is a real enemy to find you and do whatever he or she wants to do to you and then another thing is uh, don't post your uh, cast number plates it's also very risk because if you post your the number plates of your car Someone who wants to follow you or track you can easily find you because he or she knows the number plates of your car. And then uh, at, and this will expose you to more danger because they know you. They can follow you slowly and find you wherever they want. And then uh, also, don't uh, post your lavish lifestyle because it might attract attention to those who know you and they are financially unfortunate they might try they might pursue you if you post that you are lavish things that you are doing expensive clothes expensive things that you have and there is somebody there who knows you and is financially unfortunate um somebody can try to pursue you and get whatever he or she wants because you have a lot of things until you post them lavishly so and someone is unfortunate, maybe someone doesn't have anything to eat or something like that. So someone can decide to do anything to you anytime. Okay, so guys, as we come to the end, don't post expensive things that your boyfriend buys for you. Because this one is really very dangerous. If you post these things and there is a, a girl somewhere who knows you and knows your boyfriend and eats all these things and she never finds these things there is a way she will come through and make sure she takes away your boyfriend because uh, you show them that he has money he buys you everything uh, he buys you expensive things so uh, if you post this it will make it will attract some people to come to because this will make those girls jealous and they will want to snatch the, uh, your boyfriend from you so girls please uh, be careful if somebody buys you those expensive things, keep it to yourself because they are yours. And so girls, you better find a good way of celebrating your boyfriend. You are in private. Don't show off because maybe also he doesn't like you showing off. So please find a way of celebrating him in a very good way. And so guys, we've come to the end of our video today. So I am I was giving you this advice because people post the things which are not relevant and those things can lead your life into danger. So guys, please keep to this and your life will be more safer. So guys, for those who are new here, please hit the subscription button, hit the like button, leave some sweet comments in the um, comment section below. So guys, so guys, until next time, watch out for the next video. Bye bye.